This is your DNA Info update for Tuesday, May 25th. It's 75 degrees and sunny, going up to a beautiful 84 degrees later today. In your headlines, Community Board 1's meeting tonight on the proposed mosque near Ground Zero is expected to attract a large crowd, and organizers said police are making preparations. The $100 million Islamic Center has sparked controversy downtown and across the nation, even attracting the ire of the Tea Party. A mystery subway Samaritan jumped down onto the L train tracks at Union Square to save a woman who fainted and fell off the platform there. Transit officials said the mystery hero rolled the 26-year-old woman between the first and second tracks just in time to avoid a coming train. She was taken to Bellevue Hospital in stable condition, a transit spokesman said. The stars of Sex and the City 2 were back in Manhattan last night for the world premiere of their new movie. The leading ladies walked the red carpet outside Radio City Music Hall amid throngs of screaming fans. Check out our slideshow of the event, including all the best and worst dressed stars, on our website. Parents are hoping the Union Square playground reopens soon. The $3.8 million playground had to be temporarily closed to let crews build a roof over a steel dome that got too hot for children to play on. Those are your headlines. Get all your Manhattan local news at dnainfo.com.